Nikki, hello. Hey, Evan. Hi. Hi. This is a nice room you got here. Yeah, it's my uh, my art room. Kind of looks like my bedroom. Yeah, a little bit. The paint everywhere. Yeah. And the drawings of... Rats? Rats. Yeah, dude, he doesn't like rats. Nope. Or prosthetic limbs, apparently. Well, he has them. Who's he? What is this? What's going on? Nikki, what's happening? The layer is a fear. Okay. And I am a painter who is very, very angry. Um, Why are you so drunk. angry? Uh, critics don't like my recent paintings so much. Okay, all right. And uh, as this note would say in here, hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You just opened that drawer. I did. I did. Live in the same house. Oh, they talk through notes. Yeah, his wife not so happy anymore. Jeez. Yeah, he's having a little bit of a rough life right now. Unhappy wife. Um, he's drinking a little too much, and critics aren't feeling his paintings. Miserable. Miserable, miserable man. But this is the beginning of. Is what it is just? It called? Is it just Matt. this room? No. Layers of onion. No, layers of fear. Right. Fear. There are onions later, though, in the kitchen. Get it right this time. What is this, the magnum opus? Is that what it's called? Uh, that's a, sure. That's a, this, a, a work. This will become that for me. Oh, geez. Yeah, the head bob is a little um, nauseating sometimes. I noticed we got a little bit of head sway. Yeah. Got a little oh, bit like of a it. limp. I like it. Yeah, it's a little more realistic. I guess. All right, so where are we going? What's is it? Is the entire game just this room? No, we can leave. We're gonna go into my whole house. Well, let's. We should leave then. We spent Be enough time see? in this. Oh gosh. It's beautiful. That beautiful. horse is creeping. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even notice the horse. Okay. That horse is creeping. Okay. I got some paint splattered all over the place. We should. We should get out of here. Let's boogie. Yeah. All right. Here we go. We spent enough time <laughs> in this room. Oh man, that okay. door. <laughs> it seems to mirror the the open and closed physics of amnesia a little bit like that door has some weight to it yeah a little bit and i'm not so good with the controls so i noticed that when you you started <laughs> opening the door with some force and then it just kind of stopped totally goes in this is another another good painting i see a, a fish or a monster up there at the top and i think it's supposed to be a rat he really really doesn't like rats okay all right at all so this is, this is a cheery place this is yeah this is this is this is my home. I appreciate his curtaining. Alright, I gotta remember where to go now. Okay. Oh, little this way. Little bit of a linear experience, or can you explore this house? Very, very linear. Okay. Um, sometimes it'll seem like you can go in a different direction, but in reality, it will just kind of... The hallways are the same, Maybe. Notice. Maybe let's not call it linear. Guided? Is it a guided experience? Uh, no, it's linear. Okay. You really can't super explore different rooms. If you go down a right hallway, it's exactly like going down the left. Hmm. There's no difference. Um, as far as I know. I missed a lot of collectibles, though, in my full playthrough, so maybe I'm wrong. I think I went right back in this room. Good. This, this is a different room, but... No, it's not. We, we saw this painting before. That was in a different room. Was it? Oh, I can't get back out now. Alright, so this is where I need to be. This is where you need to be, apparently. <laughs> okay, so... Alright. Oh, 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 okay. I need Everything looks like a collectible to me. Yeah. I, you can't pick any of this stuff up, though. Is that... Um, you're gonna like these candles? That's a cabinet. Oh. Oh, oh, okay. Oh. I wonder what the code for that lockbox could be. I don't know. It's pretty hidden. I think this is gonna require some guesswork. Oh, man. Um, We're gonna be stuck for hours, huh? Hardcore puzzle game. Yeah, hardcore puzzle game. Look out, okay. witness. I'm not very good at... Oh, there we go. Got it. Open this box. The past holds 1,000 boars. This is how you get the story. There's... Yeah. I found a... a ring like that at my grandmother's house one time. Yeah, these are... It's like an old vintage sapphire ring. Never forget. 
Never forget. Yeah. Okay, I believe I can leave this room now. Nope. Maybe through the other door. There is no other door. Oh, okay. The one that has never forget written above it. <laughs> There's a rocking chair. You were just sitting in that rocking chair. That's why that's moving, right? No. Ghosts, maybe. I don't even know if there's ghosts in here. He's just losing his Horseradish. That means there's a ghost around. Horseradish? What? Yeah, I'm just, okay. just exclaiming something. Whoa! The deer head. Does it talk to you? I Hello, wish. Nikki. <laughs> I don't you think it, if, it call really me by, if it called me by my first name, this would be the scariest game ever. Oh, okay. Well, just... I fell the through a trap door. What kind of house is this? I don't know. It's like a fun house, almost. You're not dead. No. Okay. Just Can fun. you die? Will kind we, of. Will we see death, maybe, here? I don't... I didn't die in this particular part of the game. Okay. In my playthrough, but I don't know if you can or you... I'm not sure if you can. Okay. Who developed this? What's... Who... Where's this from? Uh, Bluebird. Okay. Very small. Very small development team. Wait a minute, check out that deer head again. Oh. He... He's got us a gift! He did, now he's got all paint all over him. I don't think that's paint. It looks like paint. Hmm. What else would it be? Blood. That's not blood. That's a when ravenous... Is, since when does... Since when does blood? Deer. Since when does blood look like that? It does now look like paint. I, I didn't see the yellow paint before. <laughs> I can spin this globe. Hot sauce, that's cool. Yeah. Can spin that. Sometimes the camera when you move stuff moves a little weird. This is the I don't know if this is a man or a woman. I like that individual's head wrap. It reminds me of Professor Quail from Harry yeah, Potter. I, I can't tell if it's supposed to be an old woman or an old man. Now it looks like a man. I know it's quarrel. From far away it kinda looks like a lady. An old lady. I still haven't decided. I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna go through this door now. Some of the doors open the opposite way. And then sometimes it does that. The controls. After you open something, it kind of just... Thrusts just... you skyward? Yeah, for no huh. reason, or like spins you around. Gonna... Uh, that's good. Beautiful paintings. Looks like... Yeah, they're all like warped. Yeah. Okay. Looks like they were made out of cutouts from a magazine. Oh! Hey! That one just didn't want to be on the wall anymore. Oh, oh! It said something on the back. I missed it. At least you get this. Oh. Yes, just like that. I'm guessing that's his wife. Maybe he did a sketch of. Okay. Um, and that's because on the back, that's her handwriting. I'm not that round. Doesn't look too round to me, but... Yeah, she looks super thin. So, oh, this door. We're in this room. Fit this people one. usually think that they're overweight. Yeah, that's pretty typical. It, it happens. Pretty typical. Okay. Well, oh, see. I was yeah. ready to enjoy that beautiful you painting. And then huh. You see the hand? I didn't notice the hand before. I guess I was I was closer, like underneath it, so I kind of just. Nope, totally still see the hand. So would you oh, say there are layers of fear to this game? No. Jeez. No. Um, but that book man was pretty scary. I, some of it's still a little creepy, I guess. So it's would a... you say it's more unsettling than scary? Yeah, the more unsettling parts would be like the paintings getting all messed up like this. They're a little, it's a little more like psychological, like mm. that kind of stuff. Yeah. Um, okay. I mean, even just now, the books kind of just falling randomly as they were floating. It's not so frightening. It's kind of expected. It's kind of the cliche, traditional type of jump scares going on. So we do uh, got jump, uh, jump scares. Yeah, a little bit. A okay. little bit. All right. A little bit sometimes. Nothing wrong with a little bit of jump scare. No. Yeah. This reminds me of PT right here. A lot of this reminds me of PT. Um, Is it as good as uh, that playable trailer? No. Playable teaser? No, it's not. And I'm not sure if it's because PT was the first to kind of do this. Walk through a house and have 
weird things happen and it's more psychedelic looking and uh, gone home came before that that was supposed to be all creepy weird i never played gone home turns out your lesbian sister ran away from home oh oh spoilers you think she's gonna be dead in the attic but nope turns out she ran away it's a lot of paprika to never have that one of those is not paprika well they're both labeled that way so I don't know. I can't pick anything up. So you're saying that that shelf it's paprika. full of preservatives. That sh All of this is paprika. Uh. All of it. See? Uh. No, I, I don't know if that's supposed um... to represent how insane <laughs> this man has gone. That everything. Uh... Well, this is oregano. Found okay. some oregano. Cool. Yeah. And then I got. Let's take apples. a moment here. Let's pop into the options. Okay. Oh, bare bones here. Okay, settings. All right. Settings. You can turn off the head bob, which I'm actually going to do Ooh, now. Field of view. I like that. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. I haven't really messed with this. That's where it was. Uh, naturally, so I guess I can do this. <laughs> Try it. But yeah, crank it. Uh, what's in the <laughs> graphics? In the graphics. It is just brightness. Hmm. Brightness, that's it. I too crank up the brightness. Uh, yeah, it, it where it was to begin with wasn't bad, but some of the the rooms are a little, a little dark. You can't really. Whoops, that's not what I meant to do. Well, this is good. You can go to the chapters after you beat the game. Perfect. Or as you're beating them, you can return to certain areas because there are collectibles and those those rat sketches that were there. Those are also collectibles towards an achievement. Find them all and get the achievement. There's family, mementos, you know, pictures, stuff like that. All that sort of stuff. Does this move change as you scroll around this menu? No. Okay, I thought I saw it changing or something. All right, I'm crazy. That would have been pretty cool. That would have been pretty cool. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back to this. I, I wonder where it's gonna drop you now. I, I'm hoping right where I was standing. Is it pretty good about that? Is the auto save all right? I haven't noticed any icons spinning other than... Nope. Okay, we're back at the beginning. Beautiful. <laughs> this is exactly where I wanted to be. That is. All right. Well... I, I, get, I get that this is a... Uh, kind of... I uh, don't want to say a one-note experience, but it... Uh, oh. I... Okay. Well, I guess I haven't... So that's a checkpoint room, and, like, I guess it dumps you prior to the next room you have entered. Okay, I did not know that that is... That or is last good. room, I should say. That is good. Uh, yeah. There's a lot of alcohol bottles, as you can tell. Ah, uh, you said he was a drunk. Yeah, very big drunk. Okay, look, all right. So yeah, when I said one note, I meant this game has, like, one... one thing it's trying to accomplish, and it's pretty much the same throughout. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's a little it's, motivational, see? It's first, first step, step is, the is the hardest. Sure is. Not wrong. And we're in my kitchen. You know, you gotta you gotta break a few eggs before you can make a human being. I don't know if he's trying to make a human being. Maybe. I can't pick up any of these pots. Well, good. You don't have any oven mitts on. Which is disappointing because I want to throw them. This game is restricting you. It's very restrictive. Well, at least you can open all these hot I can cabinets. open all of them. Um, That's a nice Facebook. painting. Oh, yeah. this game has some style. Yeah, they're, it's very much based off of all those real gothic horror paintings um, from this time period. I think it's either World War One or World War II. Um, he has them all over the place. They did a pretty good job putting them in here and making them look like the real the real thing. This is a pretty typical modern art of fruits and vegetables in a basket. Gone wrong. Yeah, which I never really understood. Looks nice though. I don't know much about art, so art is that scale. You can interact with that scale. That's yes, art. I can I can push it I can push it down, but I'm not Totally wait a, sure wait what a it minute. does. Do it from the other side. There's a dial there. Ugh. 
You can't pick up any of these. Not not the plastic grapes, not the show potatoes or the show radishes. Nothing. No. Not the carrots banana. or that banana that's going. Nope. That banana's Nothing. starting to go. Cauliflower looks Jeez. like a brain. Jeez. Let's see the cucumbers. Oh, wow. That is some nasty looking cauliflower. Uh huh. It looks like a brain. Oh, God. Get out of here. This is yeah. the I'm worst. I'm trying. I am trying. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna. I always forget how to trigger this particular room. The other other door, perhaps? No problem. Oh, oh, yep. knife. See, a knife got thrown at me. I think a lot of the problem with the jump scares, it probably would have been more frightening if you could actually see them happening. Uh, depending on the angle you come out at this door, you don't see that knife fly in. Like. Yeah, you kind of just had it appear there on the yeah, left. Yeah, before, on my first playthrough, I was standing over Perfect. here when I went to interact with the door, so I saw it out of the corner of my eye. Whoa. It's a lot of this kind of stuff. All of a sudden, hey, the room will man. change. I've yeah. done this ass, and now the room is pulsing. All the There's... stuff from the painting is falling out. Little painting, stop. Yeah spitting out all its stuff at me. That wouldn't be the worst, unless it's all eggplant. Is that all eggplant? No, there's some there's some garlic here. I'm set then. I could live on garlic, whoa. See, yep, and the paintings change based on, I guess, his state of mind. I'm not really... You can do something with this. First, oh, I can examine it. Oh, for it. okay. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not so, just any canvas. Not one of those bread ones. It yep. needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed oh, the skin. Oh, okay. Boots uh -huh. help mm -hmm. keep my mm -hmm. hands steady. Always. Yeah, he's, he's an artist trying to do his final, his final masterpiece. I'm guessing he used, well, he obviously used skin canvas, but I'm not sure if it's his or his wife's he used. Hmm. Yep, so we come through here, discover that whole thing. Oh, this is my memento book. It's not, I have missed a lot of them. It's my wedding picture. Happy day. Pregnant wife. A letter my wife wrote saying how happy she was. That's pretty much it. I didn't find many of them yet. Hmm. And then, another note. You're a professional. Yeah, he was a renowned painter, and uh, the critics are not liking him so much anymore compared to the way he used to be. Geez, this is like the story of Brian Wilson, of the Beach Boys. Yeah, a little bit. He little also bit. went insane when he couldn't recapture the so, magic. Okay. After finding that canvas piece okay, let's... of human skin, we get to paint. Let's paint a little bit painting so you just kind of vibrate violently and yeah and will the paint onto paint the paint see that looks like flamingos right there that does some pretty sinewy flamingos mm. oh geez uh yep i don't know how especially that one in the back i don't know how cool i am with this but it's a little, a little creepy a little it's got disturbing. some style it's actually one of the critics uh newspaper clippings you find that the critic says that the new paintings would be better off at the psychologist's office and not, and not in a gallery. So people people are noticing that he's losing his mind a little bit. Mm. Slow and steady, slow and steady. And then once you uh, finish these steps up or chapters, got these little locked boxes so you can see that there's six. Only six? Yeah, six. Six. Mm -hmm. How long does this game run you? I would say anywhere from three to four hours, depending. Probably oh, shorter wow. if you kind of just speed through it. And this is the end of the first chapter. Hmm. Get to go back through the store. And how shapeless jeans. Now how oh dreams. dreams. How how much does this cost? Twenty. Twenty? Nineteen ninety nine on the store. Yeah. That's not terrible for what it is. I mean, no, I, it's, it's I think a lot fifteen of style. would have been a little bit of a better price point, but who's but who's complaining? It's a lot of style. Oh yeah, crank that. Mm. Yep, yeah, going up, 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 up in my house, in my elevator. And I guess, wow, what? Who has an elevator in their house? Maybe what a rock star. 
Yeah, he, he's very wealthy. The Mick he's Jagger very wealthy painting. Couple. Yeah. All right. Well, I don't want I don't want to spoil too much of this because it sounds like the story, the progression is all it's got going for it. So. Thanks. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Nikki. No problem. Don't worry.